I've been feeling so, I've been feeling so down, yeah. Can you tell me why? Can you tell me why? Waking up early is definitely a challenge, but now I'm ready for the day because I'm freshened up and I have to drink my water because I gotta stay hydrated for the rest of the day. Here is my most complimented perfume, Chao by Vince Komodo. I'm going to share with you guys my work essential. First up is my card holder. Then, car and garage keys. Let's not forget about the lip balm. Of course, ponytail and hair clips. Now, let's not forget the phone. Forget everything but not the phone. And AirPods. Before you leave for work, make sure you leave your spouse a kiss goodbye to start the day.
good morning guys and I'm sorry um, if the first first part of this vlog is actually a quiet one because this is this vlog I'll call it a day in the life of a dialysis nurse so I'm gonna show you the things that I do on a morning shift my routines and also yeah just random stuff in between just mind you guys I'm not documenting everything um, on this day because of privacy and of course confidentiality reasons and also as a professional I, I shouldn't have to do that because um, being a nurse is that we have a lot of responsibility and one of that is also respect the privacy of our workplace and also the life of our patients and especially when it comes to data or information that we spread in the internet so i hope you guys understand but at least you have now uh, an insight of what we do on a daily basis so yeah i'm gonna take you guys with me if you like this one please click that like button subscribe to the channel and also guys please share this to the nurses that you know and maybe they can relate <laughs> so yeah oh i'm already late let's go all right guys i think i'm good to go it's now 6.39 let's hope that I'm not gonna be super super late and today's ride is DC because whoever car is parked first or nearest to the door and whoever goes out first that person shall take that car if that makes sense so, close our door make sure it's locked Yep. Just a simple reminder before you go anywhere, say your prayers because um, at any time, given time of the day, we can encounter accidents and especially like we're working, um, we can have accidents anywhere. So just be mindful and of course pray, pray, pray because I think that really serves its purpose. God always protects us. I don't know if you can see me then, um, but my usual travel time is 10 to 15 minute stops. There's no traffic, but this is Canberra, okay? So we don't usually have traffic here, unlike in different states. Ooh, 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 ooh. I wanna show you this one. So that's a hot air balloon and somebody is flying today it's actually a nice weather today so hopefully it won't rain but it was a bit gloomy this whole week I hope today is gonna be better shout out to my vloggers John, now, who does this really for a full-time living vlogging um, yeah I don't know how you guys do it <laughs> I am inconsistent with my uploading time and my thing, but yeah, I'm trying my be my best really. Um, I just have a full time vlog, and I also want to give a big big shout out to my fellow nurses who's actually away by 5 a.m. Uh, like I do, and getting things ready, sort of things out for their family and their kids, and yeah, he goes to work with like a full concentration or focus that you know um, it's gonna be a good day to work today so, yeah really really admire every one of us guys family but it's uh, it's already hard waking up in the morning but I'm also a morning person I don't know I love all the shifts I'm not picky I love morning afternoon and night shifts um, but, but I really do appreciate now that I don't have a lot of night shifts because it just gives me and Roel a lot of time together. And like before, before we had the house, I, if you want me to do a vlog about that, about how I did manage to, to try and cope with double shifts and also a different workplace, um, I will do that one, even though if you don't request, but if you do, comment down below and yeah so it was really tough for us because there are nights that i don't sleep at home um and that's 
not really a good thing but now we're like um compensating or coping with that lost time so i really love that about what i do now i'm at the parking area now i should stop talking So, you know how, guys. <laughs> Let's vlog. I'm not gonna take the camera with me, guys, because it's hard. So, anyway, we just paid our parking. And let's put our parking right here so the man in uniform can see that. And we're good to go, guys. So, walking down to my workplace. I'm sorry, I'm using my phone now. So guys, so I'm here at my workplace now. Sorry, I'm taking my phone with me. Just so um, my workmates won't be as suspicious that I'm vlogging today. And I don't want it to be awkward. So, yeah. Right. Time check, I think it's already 7 o'clock. But, eh, sorry if it's shaky. To start a shift, we must be ready with our headgears on, face shield, and mask. First responsibility of a dialysis nurse is water testing and lining of the machine for our morning patients. Time check, it's probably around 9.30 to 10 in the morning. We have hooked on all our patients and I'm just putting their details on the computer. At this point, our, most of our patients are for monitoring, so we do an early checking and make sure that everything's okay. If we hear buzzer is alarming, that means you have to attend them as quickly as possible. Now I'm off. It was hectic, but it was okay. Alright guys, so time check it's now 3:10 and kakatapos ko lang mag work just finished working and <sighs> sorry guys um as what i've said due to confidentiality reason i'm not going to vlog inside the workplace but it was just to give you a bit of an overview of what happened today it was a crazy shift we started a bit busy already and then things happened. One of our patients was a bit, his access is not working. He's got this um, CVC access and it's not working. So we had to call the dialysis access nurse and I had to send him home and he had to go to the hospital. So it's quite, quite chaotic. And um, luckily for me, my patients were a bit stable. I just was there to help my colleagues if that makes sense otherwise we would be like running around ve being very very busy because you know not having problems with our patients so yeah i was able to lend a hand to um a good colleague so um yeah i was supposed to like vlog or like record my um break time but it didn't happen because well life so i only have about 20 minutes break today and um not really a bit a crazy schedule i didn't expect it to happen but it did but anyway um that's about it for this vlog thank you for watching a day in the life of a dialysis nurse thank you guys please don't forget to subscribe to my channel also like the thumbs up button and yeah please share this guys if you have um friends that are nurses and who's having this kind of crazy shift as well like I do and also the other day as nurses um, I really wanted to take you guys with me but yeah I'll see how this goes and hopefully um, you like it uh, yeah I'm also giving a huge shout out to all nurses across the globe because we guys are doing a really really a good job and 
yeah thank you so much guys for following me and for watching my vlogs really appreciate it again this is oh sheila reminding you to inspire like wildfire dream big dreams and maybe one day you too can be a dialysis nurse here in australia or maybe anywhere bye